One of my favorite lessons to do about proteins is this pipe cleaner activity my AP students did in class today. Let's show you how I made the connection between these pipe cleaners and a protein. First of all, my students are learning about the four different structures of a protein and how the amino acid sequence determines the shape and function of a protein. So for class today, my students were given the task of making one of these different types of proteins. Their protein had to be at least six amino acids long, but not more than 12. And their structure had to be similar to their function. Now they could choose any of the amino acids, but they had to remember how these amino acids fold within a protein. Oh yeah, the amino acids also have a particular shape and they had to include this shape in their proteins. The students then had to draw out their polypeptide or amino acid on their lab stations, as well as making their protein. When the students were done with their protein, they submitted a picture of their work on Google Classroom. Groups also have to name their protein and shout out to this group, I love the name, Woman Stemmen, love it. Part of the reason I absolutely love this activity was that each group had a different protein structure and function. And as you can see, there were a lot of cool designs of different proteins and how they folded, creating a different structure and a different function. Shout out to my students, you guys rock.